guys i'm mark today i'm going to show you how to work out the output of a function machine if you are given the input so let's have a look at our first example so we have a two operation function machine so the first thing we're doing is adding on four and the second operation is to multiply by eight so part a tells us to find the output if five is the input so first of all let's write down our number five so the first thing we need to do then is add four to five so five add four is nine then copy nine down onto your next line so our next operation is to times by eight so nine eights are seventy two so the output will be 72 when the input is 5. So let's do part B. So find the output if the input is minus 7. So we just need to be careful with our negative numbers here. So if you write minus 7 down first as the input. So the first operation is to add 4. So minus 7 add 4 takes us up to minus 3. Then copy minus 3 onto the next line. So the next operation is to times by 8. So minus 3 times positive 8 would be negative 24. So that would be the output. So let's look at one more example. So this time we have a 3 operation function machine. So to get the output, we need to divide the input by 4, then add on 2, and then times it by 7. So part A, find the output when the input is 40. So if you write down 40 at the start, so first of all we need to divide it by 4. So 40 divided by 4 is 10. Copy 10 to the next line. So the next operation is to add 2. So 10 add 2 is 12. Then put 12 on the next line. And then the final operation is to times it by 7. So 12 times 7 is 84. So 84 is the output. So part B then, so find the output when the input is 12. So let's copy down 12. So our first operation is to divide by 4. So 12 divided by 4 is 3. Put this on the next line. So the next operation is plus 2. So we need to add 2 to the 3. So 3 add 2 is 5 and then the final operation is to multiply by 7 so if we copy the 5 down and times it by 7 so 5 sevens are 35 so that would be the output so i hope you like this video if you did like and subscribe and i'll see you soon with a new video Bye.